Roman concrete is some of the most durable material on the planet, and for centuries it baffled scientists. But recently we actually figured out that it's volcanic ash, water, and ancient dead sea life. Hi everyone, astrobiologist here to talk about my Roman Empire. One of the big reasons we know anything at all about Roman history is that all their stuff's still here. The Pantheon, the aqueducts, the Colosseum, all that stuff is made out of a much, much, much more durable concrete than we can make today. In 2023, scientists made the discovery that Roman concrete is ash, water, and something called lime, which is not the fruit, but the highly heated product of limestone. Now limestone is really awesome stuff because it's calcium carbonate, which is made of dead marine life. Shells, bones, coral, things like that. Back in the Jurassic period, which we all recognize as the good one with the dinosaurs, Europe was underwater. It was under the Tethys Ocean, and the Tethys Ocean was full of classic weird little ocean guys. Maybe big weird ocean guys. Ichthyosaurus, some big weird snakes, and my personal favorite, Elasmosaurus. Look at him. When these creatures died, their bones and shells and all that stuff sank to the bottom of the ocean, where it became a part of the sediment. Now millions of years go by and that sediment compacts and it stacks on top of itself and it becomes sedimentary rock, it becomes limestone. So if we fast forward to the near present, all that limestone has been lifted up to the surface by geologic processes where Romans can dig it out of quarries and use it for all kinds of materials. Now here's why Roman concrete is so good. It's self-healing. So when water enters a little tiny crack in the limestone, it will encounter one of these lime clasts, which is just a little chunk of lime. That will dissolve the lime clasts and it'll make a little sludge and the sludge will fill the crack and then there's no more crack. So at this point, the limestone has literally healed itself. And this fix is actually stronger than the original material itself. So Roman concrete does not become weaker over time. It actually becomes stronger with time and weathering. All of this is thanks to an ocean that does not exist anymore. And creatures that died millions of years ago, unaware that the earth wasn't quite done with them yet. Anyways, Thanks for tuning in and keep an eye out for my upcoming book, Life in Seven Numbers, available from Princeton University Press in summer 26.